Our science department has amazing professors. All of them are constantly continuing their own education, not only to further their knowledge, but to also help us. Um, they have great connections. You know, they set us up with the best opportunities, you know, in order to succeed. My ideal plan is to be a high school biology teacher. Um, I would want to teach biology, like anatomy, physiology, genetics and microbiology, those types of classes. At VCSU, when you come into the math or science department, especially if you're in math education or science education, you're not only going to get the undergraduate education that we would normally use um, to prepare math and science teachers, but you're also going to get an opportunity to work towards the STEM initiative, STEM meaning science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, which is kind of revitalizing the way we train teachers to really get students engaged in the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics through different types of teaching that maybe weren't present many years ago. The health science majors, the pre-professionals, um, you know, people that want to go to uh, optometry, vet school, med school, chiropractic, that kind of stuff, uh, also graduate school. That's mainly the focus. I'm actually a transfer student, and once I came here, I talked to Professor Hildy and Professor Stickler, and they're like, you might as well just triple major then because you only have these extra two classes to take, a few extra credit hours aren't much to do on top of our schedule. And I'm actually going to be out in four years with three majors. So, pretty impressive. Well, right now I'm, I'm enrolled in anatomy and physiology. And uh, if I'm going to go on to med school, that's going to be a huge, huge part of it. But there are other courses that they have a lot of real world aspects to it. Like right now I'm in uh, quantitative analysis. And that's a chemistry class. And we just went over the theory behind global warming and everything. In exercise science, I am trying to like learn all about the body so then I can uh, use it in later f fields. Like maybe, I'm not sure what I want to be yet, but maybe I want to be a coach so then I can use it there. Or maybe a, a personal trainer like my brother. So. Our teachers are like past personal trainers and they really like have the experience on their part to teach us. Our math and science programs are really growing right now, especially in the sciences um, with a fish and wildlife major and we have many research grants that are being provided to open up opportunities. I always knew that I wanted to uh, go into like ecology and a wildlife related profession. I looked over here and had everything I wanted, but I still have that uh, luxury of having a small class and the attention from the professors. A lot of field work is uh, oriented into it, which I really enjoy, and this is something that I wouldn't be able to get out of going to a larger university. We learn different techniques that we'd use in like real world research, such as uh, banding ducks, trapping uh, minnows and minnow nets, and uh, sampling aquatic invertebrates. And it's a great program for anybody wanting to be a game warden or environmental consulting. I've already been on one publication, and, and that'll be good to build on a resume. And, If I go to grad school, I'm hoping to go towards research and maybe cancer research in the future. Hildy got me hooked up with one of the instructors at NDSU, and I will actually be doing research on human cancer tissue this summer. I've been working at Northern Prairie Wildlife Research Center in Jamestown. There's a lot of different uh, wildlife professionals within the state, and my advisor knows most of them, and uh, he takes uh, his students to meetings, professional, like the Wildlife Society meetings, and that's a great place to meet uh, potential employers. Valley City has really prepared me for what I want to do when I move on. Teachers have been there for me, and I know they'll continue to be there for me even when I leave and go on to professional school. And I don't think that you'd get that anywhere else. I love teaching. I love seeing kids come in as you know the shy 18 year old not sure what they want to do and then at the end of the four years they walk away and you know they know what they want to do they're confident they they got a success in a lot of cases because either they got a job or they you know they went on to graduate school you know there's nothing cooler than um, having a phone call from somebody saying, my interview went great or I got into something 
Our teachers are so passionate about what they do. Every day they have just that enthusiasm in the classroom, which really, I mean, it, you know, overflows to the students. Every once in a while I walk in a classroom and especially when they're working on these projects and I see that they're having fun with it and they're into it, I'm the happiest person on the planet because I, I think that, yes, we made it work. And I think that is part of our job is to show them the possibilities, to show them that there's more to science and that there's a really interesting stuff out there that they might never have thought about. And so uh, we have a lot of students that come here as I want to be a chiropractor and end up going to graduate school and getting a PhD. And, and you know, that is one of those where you say, yes, cool. <laughs>